We are located two blocks from Georgia Southern University. We offer all-inclusive two, three, and four bedroom flats and townhomes available in individual or full unit rates. We are loaded with amenities and fun. Keep your body looking and feeling good in our fitness center or catch a movie in our movie theater. Enjoy rays of sun beside our pool or tan for free in our standing tanning dome. Beat your friends in a game of pool or have a cookout by our lake. Stop by the finest location in the borough at 710 Georgia Avenue. this bus a little different? Oh, the paint job, the interior, it's all new, football tables, carpet, air conditioner, the rims, it says Eagle on the side of them, and the stickers, the logos on the outside. You guys get a lot of people uh, commenting on this? Yes, a lot. About everybody come by, we have seven or signatures inside of Tracy Helm and other football players that came in and signed the bus. Bubba, what's going on? Josh, I'll tell you what's going on. Dancing with the Statesboro Stars is October the 1st. And Marcy and I are doing one last fundraiser. It's next Thursday up at Ag South. We're selling barbecue plates. They're $10 each. All proceeds go to Safe Haven. Here's a beautiful ticket. Look at this. Oh, there goes one. That's free. Beautiful tickets. Now. A lot of people are saying, well, Bubba, we just weren't going to be in town or can't eat dinner with you on Thursday. But, and we said, okay, we got a great idea. We're going to have a ticket that you can just do a $10 donation. So you may miss out on the barbecue, but you can still donate to a great cause, which is Safe Haven. So anything you do is grateful and helpful. So all you got to do is look us up on Facebook and donate. How's the dancing coming? Marcy? It's coming. He's getting better. He's getting better. Any clues on what we're doing? I'll give you one clue. Kind of do it like this. <laughs> John Revolta. Something like that. <laughs> hey, it's coming. Call us. We're selling tickets next Thursday. Ax out from 11 to 1. Come help out. And what do we got on the grill today? Risk it. I'll call you. Bye. Pork loin. Fresh sausage from Ellis. Picking the ribs up. Put on my secret sauce. <laughs> Chicken. This is the Army STEM truck, uh, science, technology, engineering, and math. It's basically uh, designed to show that there's more to the Army than just like shoot them up, bang bang type stuff. 
Um, it's, the trailer is divided into to three different sections. So basically, the, the first uh, section they go to gives gives um, like a fake broadcast of terrorist activity. Um, it's not real; it's all made up. And then they move on to room two. That talks about some robotics uh, that's used to go into the building afterwards to help people and, and see who's ever in the building. And it also gives some information uh, that they'll need to go into room three, where then they'll do a hands-on on the touch screen uh, on the computer to guide the robot through four different objectives. And it, it's, it keeps score. Um, but basically, uh, normally how they do it is whoever gets the highest score out of it, they'll come out and the recruiters will give them you know, a prize or something like that. How has this been received? Uh, it's actually uh, a pretty good um, as far as like a lot of high schools have the STEM program. So when they bring the, uh, the STEM students out, they, they enjoy it because that's what they're into. Uh, so it, it's definitely, uh, you know, has a good turnout when we go to places.